I can make a living from walking in the woods. You can bet I be sitting pretty good high on a hill, looking at a field downwind. If I can make a nickel off of turning in bass, never worry about the price of gas. I be wheeling and dealing and sitting there reeling them in. What's up guys? I am heading to Thompson Temple right now. I am super excited. My buddy Zach Heron invited me to go out there um, uh, a couple weeks ago. So I am kind of excited to get some redemption since I missed a uh, chance to do a spot stock on a trophy Hawaiian at the Wissestad Ranch a couple months ago. Um, this guy has all rams, pretty much every species. So that's what we're going to be going after. Um, uh, I am planning on going after a doll. Um, but the uh, great thing about this guy's ranch is that he has nothing but rams, so he said that if you see anything else, which they've seen mountain lions, uh, access, black buck, and a bunch of other different species that hop over from um, neighboring ranches, he said you can shoot for free. So we're very much pumped about that. But uh, just want to thank my buddy Zach again for inviting me, and the Pursuit TV guys are going to be out there. So um, it's going to be a blast. But I'll keep you guys updated. Hopefully we can get some bone on the ground. So. reception in my uh, <laughs> my phone Thompson Temple Ranch two miles heck yeah let's see uh, let's see if I can get the gate code to work here Whew, that was a fun trip I just seen a bunch of black buck in the Yeah, let's do this. I'm gonna show you how you can tell you're in a good spot to hunt. Huh, look at that, still going. All the way through, nothing. Just awesome. This road though is freaking deadly, I can tell you that right now. That train is just something cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my old pan is laying about a mile back. And my front bumper is probably laying back there with it. Rough. Holy God. Oh my God. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is bad. Oh shit. Nice and easy car. Oh. Wow, you talk about rough. 
This is rough. Oh, I can't say I'm not happy to see that, that's for sure. Finally. How's it going? Good, man. So somebody got one, huh? I did it. Nice. It's what? Uh, here for, to hunt this yeah. Yeah. Thompson's not here, man. Have you been here before? No. <laughs> Have you been here before? No. I've been here quite a few times. So I talked to Ray, which is his helper. Yeah. He said Thompson's like in New Valley, and he should be back this afternoon. Kay. We're about to leave, but um, and we're just gonna meet Ray in town to settle up with him. But okay. I don't know the other. I was gonna say, where's the other place? Is that 400 you, you, yards or you feet? You may be. You may be. It's I, pretty rough getting down there. I was worried there. about that. Uh, yeah, it's it, it. You follow this thing, and it like looks like you're dead into like a washout, like a riverbed. Yeah. And then you just take the riverbed right, and you go up. You can get through that and get up there. You go past a set of pins. Yep. You see like a red pickup and a set of pins, and then you go and you just keep following the road, and it comes up, and there's like a there's a single light up there. That's the cowboy casa. Okay. But you should be all right all the way till you get up to the point to come up to the trailer, and then I would park down at the bottom and just walk. It's like okay. it's yeah, like this is fifty yards. Drive. <laughs> it's not that; it's just ground clearance. Oh, it's all rock. So gotcha. Oh, well, I appreciate it, buddy. Thank you very much. Congratulations, by the way. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta get that. All right. They were not exaggerating about this train being rough. I could barely make it with my SUV, and my SUV is jacked up. These roads are washed out rock. And I mean, there is levels of rock all the way. This is our house, our place we're staying is right there. And it is, I gotta climb up that to get to it. So we're gonna try and hope that I can make it up that because that is one steep ass freaking hill. Oh man, we made her. Cowboy Casa. Woo. Home sweet home for a couple days. Talking about rough living, they weren't kidding. I mean, it's. It's not horrible. It's a double wide. The floor is made of plywood. You know, there's uh, there's holes everywhere. But you know, it's, we'll live for the weekend. Not bad. We'll be hunting 24 seven, so can't see us being here for more than a couple hours of sleep at night. But uh, accommodates quite a few people. Bed set up. At least it's cold in here. That's all that mattered to me. AC is running. So, definitely happy. Not happy about that. Just saying. Otherwise, can't wait to be here. I have to wait for Zach to get here. As you guys seen, some guy shot a, a ram with like a Corsica up on top. So, it's good. See what happens. There's a plastic like a bee. Like a bee I'm going to go roll this hay out. I'll be right back. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Do you need help? No, no I can get it. Thank you. They just, right they just truck itself right on out.
opening. Nobody loves my ass. <laughs> there you go, bro. Shit, these rams don't even love you, man. They ran from you. <laughs> they didn't run from shit, me. Shit, I was 20 yards from them. That's how far I was, but I couldn't shoot them because they were in the thick shit and they kept walking away. Well, see, his whole body was out for me to shoot. But I didn't know what tags they were. Dude, Shane left his fucking release <laughs> down there <laughs> in that valley when we stopped to take a break. Yeah. Like, we all get up to the top, and he's like, oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> I was like, damn, you're just carrying a paperweight now. I can't even shoot a ram. What's up, guys? I'm at uh, Thompson Temple Ranch right now. Um, the train here is just crazy, as you can see in the background here. I mean, there's just huge rock cliffs. And it's uh, just nuts. We've been having a heck of a time. We actually could have shot some really nice size Morenos yesterday, but we kind of passed on them just to see what uh, what we've seen, but it's a scorch out right now. It's over 100 degrees. Um, I'm just doing a little spot and stock right now, and uh, let's see if I can find them. It's 600 acres all together, so it's, it's a lot of up and down, but uh, we'll see what we can get done right now. I'm using um, Eat the Tree Scent Spray. Hunting, fishing, so I know my scent will be covered, but uh, we'll see if we can sneak up on one and get a shot. Welcome to the drop zone, got you in the crosshairs. Once I pull this trigger, they're gonna haul you out of here. Hunting is a lifestyle, survival of the fittest. We on a hunt, what you want? Come on, now you in a drop zone. Exhale, exhale, one shot, one kill. Drops on y'all, we don't play. We chase them big old hogs, big 
trucks with over dogs. It's all American to hunt and tow the gun. Climb up in that tree stand. Got a muzzle loader in my hand. Big buck walking in the sight. Game over, drops on good night. That's one of the bigger Texas dolls that I was after. For a, oh, that was a bait group. That was, that was the hardest hunt I've ever had. They brought me all the way up to the top of this. And uh, I couldn't get the camera set up. I'm by myself, you know, I got a, I got the Canon G30 with a full size tripod. It was, uh, it was really hard to set up, but I got him to stop for a little bit. I set up and uh, I had to wait for that, uh, that big core skin to step back to give me a clear shot. But I mean, I heart shot him. He, he's gonna be going down down here, so I'm so excited. But I wanna thank uh, uh, Be The Tree for my scent cover. Uh, it is amazing. I wanna thank Zach for bringing me out here. This has been a heck of an experience. Um, Zach and Thompson are still hunting right now. Um, they're going after some uh, some really big no takes. So hopefully they got something, but uh, let's go recover this ram. Thanks guys, see ya. So you can see where I smoked him right here. I mean, it was just instant blood pouring out of him. He's gushing. That's definitely a good old fashioned heart shot, boys. It's not a hard track job. I'm gonna have a heck of a time on top of this hill. Here, you know, backpack, my bow, quiver, tripod camera. It's gonna be a doozy. Let's see if, uh, oh yeah, this, this ain't a hard blood trail to follow by any means. Heck no. Just a gushing. bleeding just pouring I can't believe he made it this far oh <laughs> there he is oh man I am so excited oh let's set the hoit down right here Oh man, heck yeah. Pretty good, high on a hill, yeah. looking at a field downwind. Oh. If I can make a nickel off a of turning in bass, never worry about the price of gas. Real. I've been wheeling and dealing Man, and sitting good. there reeling them in. Oh. Oh. Hunting, fishing, loving every day. That's the prayer that I come. 